I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a deer. I'm going to take three fingers at the top, in the middle, and put a dot. And from that dot going towards the right, I draw a straight line, curve line down, come back to the dot, straight line, curve line down. Come right about here, we're going to draw a big curve line out, in, and leave it floating. Come on the right, uh, left hand side, we're going to draw a big curve line out, curve line in, and leave it floating also. Come back over here on the right and we're just going to go zigzag, zigzag, zigzag and leave it floating. Come on the left, we're going to do the same thing, zigzag, zigzag and leave it floating also. Okay? Come over here on the left and we're going to draw straight line down, curve line in, curve line in, leave it floating. On the right hand side, do it again, straight line down, curve line in, curve line down, and connect. Come right here at the top and we're going to draw curve line, straight line down, leave it floating. Come on the right, curve line, straight line down, leave it floating. Right here at the bottom we're going to draw curve line curve line, curve line, connect. Come right here in the center, draw a straight line, curve line to the left, come back, straight line, curve line to the right. Right underneath, baby curve line. Come back inside, on the right, we're going to draw a curve line up, curve line down, connect on the right, Curve line up, curve line down, connect on the left. Come inside and draw a little curve line on the right, little curve line on the left. Take a half curve line inside on the left, half curve line inside on the right. Come right about here and we're just going to draw straight line curve line off the page come on this side on the right straight line curve line off the page come all the way back up here on the right curve line out curve line in curve line out curve line in curve line out in out in curve line curve line connect. Come on the right hand side, I mean left hand side, sorry. Let's start and do the bottom. Let's draw a curve line, curve line up, curve line in, curve line up, two, in, out, curve line down, curve line out, curve line in, connect. Okay, I think that's all. Alright, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put a base color of apricot or peach or beige all the way on my deer. Now, I looked up deer and there are so many different kinds with so many different kinds of markings. So if you want to do a specific type of deer, it really does come down to their markings. This is just a generic kind of deer. So I go and I put a first coat. We're going to do a couple of layers of color. First coat is going to be light because you always work light to dark. Then I take my black and I color in my eyes so that my deer is looking to the sides. Okay. And then I take my brown. Oops. Sorry. Forgot my nose. Color this in black and some of you might want to color this little space black too. Then I take my brown 
and lightly I go over the color I already did loop de loop it and this gives you a little bit more texture and definition on the color of your deer and like I said there's all different kinds of deer in all different kinds of places they really get around and depending on what kind of deer you're doing will kind of pretty much determine how he's gonna or she's gonna look okay I'm gonna leave my antlers white and I'm going to take my brown and just put a couple of dots for texture again on my muzzle okie dokie okay then I took a green and my deer is in the forest so I'm just gonna give him a green stripe background now what you could do is draw the trees mountains environment that your deer would be found in okay let's see what this looks like all colored in here's my deer all colored in this deer is for Emma and it might be fun to make a bunch of different deer and have a herd okay bye bye